You guys are welcome to follow along um, and as you listen if you'd like. The year is 1889. In early March, when the snow had begun to melt, the Marshall family set out on a journey. 12-year-old Samuel, along with his mother, father, and nine-year-old sister Rachel, climbed into a covered wagon and headed west, along with several other family members. Their destination was Indian Territory, where land was plentiful and free for the taking. Their plan was to stake a claim, start a new life, and build a new town from the crowded cities of the East Coast. The wagon was packed with everything they owned, but were they prepared for what lay ahead? Now, six weeks later, they arrive in the dry, dusty territory. It is your job to help them make it in this new land. Ask some questions, and then I'll call people and put their hands up, okay? Where are they at? Where's their destination? Okay. Did you have the answer? What is the name of his sister? Rachel. What is the year? Okay. Why are they leaving where they're at? That's a good one. Huh? Um, yeah. Because the East Coast was too crowded. It was too crowded? Anybody else have another answer? Where are they leaving from? Yeah. That's very good. Okay. How long did it take them to arrive where they're at? Six weeks. Very good. Okay. So the second part is the next part of the journal. I'm going to read to you guys on this one. Boom. What a happy day this is. After eight weeks traveling across the Great Plains, we finally made it to Indian Territory, where we will stake our claim. It was just in time, too, as our water supply is dangerously low. Father set up camp close to a stream, but the water looks rather murky. Is it safe to drink? We better not take a chance. Perhaps we can collect rainwater in some of Mother's pots and pans. But what if it doesn't rain? We could die of thirst in this heat. There must be a way to clean the water from the stream. Maybe I can use some of Mama's sewing cloth to make a filter. So the first question. How long did it take them to get where they're at? Six weeks. Nope. In the black and orange, uh, oh, you put your hand down? Eight. No? Huh? Eight. Very good. Okay. Um, let's see. How is their water supply? Very low. Very good. Where did they set up camp? Um, what does it say goodbye? Very good. Okay. And what does their water look like? Murky. Very good. Okay. And the last one. Thumbs up if you agree that it is or if you think that it's not. Is the water safe to drink? Very good. <laughs> That's question. Very good. The next step is... They said that they were going to try and make the water safe to drink. So what are they going to do? Filter. Filter. Okay. So the next step of this activity is we are going to filter water. So the, what we're going to do is design a water filter. Um, for To do this design, uh, you're going to have these materials. Cotton balls, paper towels, tissues, fabric scraps, coffee filters, sand, or small pebbles. You have to choose at least two of the materials to create the filter, okay? That's right. going to list what the problem is, what their problem is, and what do you want to happen, okay? Who can tell me in the story what their problem was? Our first group, Alina, Maddie and Penny. Second group, Logan D, Hoyt, Will.
to get into after we finish how the bill becomes a law um, known as westward expansion it's going to be your next unit okay 